Hello and welcome. Next I'd like to show you that how to replace this car's side, this rubber plate and this uh, panel. And this panel's purpose is to protect this door when we open it. And now I will first do so that that, uh, that this door opens in that way and there is the switch in there and first I will show you that that how to take this this panel away if you like like paint or do something things in there or, or in in then this plate if this plate is loosened also that it is moving that how how we can fix and install that plate back and and first step is that that when I am planning to take that that side panel away that I need flat screwdriver and flat means that there is this kind of head and I start this job in here that I little bit carefully I start to bend that thing in here and I, I press that in this direction in there and same time a little bit bend that in up in here and and carefully that I don't destroy or damage this car paint and then when it's it starts to move in that way I start to bend it more in this direction in that way that I, I move that and same time when I bend that I I pull that in in here in this direction. Okay, and now now it starts to open. And when we look in that side, you can see that it starts to open nicely. In that way, good. And I take a little bit better view. Then this panel is away. Okay, and there is this door opening switch in there okay and then then i like to show you that how to install then this panel back if if it is we have many cases in that kind of situation and then we think that how we can install that in back and, and next i'll i will show that okay and then when we are planning to install this uh, moving panel back or what we have take away we need to do at least next three things first is cleaning that we need to clean both sides in this also in that side and then that side and this cleaning happens so that that we need to take first clean cotton cloth that we take all dusties and wet conditions away in here as we can see that there is this black dusty and it goes in here this is the first thing that we take all of those stuff away and also in that other area in here this must be also clean carefully and all all dirt is away and then when we can there is some glue in here and it, it may be good to only let them be in here and use this cotton cloth and then I take some other things what we need to do. Okay, and then we need brush, what is metal brush, and these are like full of metal pikes in here. And this brush is very useful when we like to clean these areas, and, and this also, this metallic spike are sharp, and they do more in here, this friction. And, and carefully only a little bit in here and especially that side what is in here this is good to clean in that way that I I move that and then I clean this area that there is this friction okay good and then what we do next and in all areas both this metal brush cleaning and then we need specific Special cleaning thing, what name, name is uh, thinner, and this is this is like car 
painting thinner and this is extremely good this cleaner but also it's very dangerous to us and that's work always in outside when you open that gap because this thinner liquid it damages our brains and also bread system this is like something like like small suanid and it is it is this is very dangerous and no any children but cleaning material it's excellent and, and again clean cotton cloth and then a little bit insert in here this there is this thinner now and I clean these things in that way because this this takes all materials nicely away and that and at other side also and then we continue again okay, and I, I must to cap cap in this canister because this thinner, thinner smells is smell is so horrible it smells like like disaster and now I clean that side also carefully and there is again this dusty thing and and then I think that area and now I believe that it, it start to be good both sides excellent excellent thing and then we can go to next step what is the maybe the most important that we need high quality glue and I have in here this high quality glue and this brand is Sika and this this product has been made in Switzerland but in United States and in Europe we can find this uh, product the Sika brand and, uh, and, and then use Sika product what is also glue and elastic and this Sika bond 32 is that kind of material and there is this information that this thing can keep 250 kilos if we have 10 centimeters per 10 centimeters plate and 250 kilos is like 500 pounds and it's huge force and now when we check that my amount in here this plate is almost one centimeter and that means that when I install this Sikapon glue in here back area this plate can keep that I need force to take this away it's 500 pounds force and it's huge force and it's like 250 kilos and it's it's extremely well well glue and the idea is now that I will install this my glue in that area only in central and then I will press that in down in here and we, we need to do that it next okay and then I, I have this metallic piston tool what compress this this glue what is it inside in here and it comes out in that area and this glue is the most critical thing and then I insert that only in this central and of course black glue is better and in this Sika brand we have also black glue, glue this black color stuff and and then remember this Sika is really harmful to our skin if this goes to my skin like in that area it is very difficult to take away and that's use always clothes because this Sika is so this grip is so hard and this lasts something like 10 to 20 years this elasticity and please say that if you could find better product than Sika I would be very happy because I have used that product like 30 years and this quality has been always excellent and then I release this piston force in that way that this glue don't go, go out and then I need this and actually we need another my favorite brand what is this 3M 3M and this is cot and this is made in United States and this 3M is the best tape and please say that if you could find better and I have used also that Scott tape 
like like 40 years and it's it's so excellent and I can say that 3m and then idea is that that I press that my panel in back in here and then in all areas I compress that in this way and now it seems that when this glue is little bit coming out that that, that there is little bit too much that and that's that's it's good to good to do so that that use the same color glue because now I need to carefully paint these things or do something because now there is this white material and now the Sika how it works it takes already contact but I think that I need to do this double fastening that I insert my my scot tape in here and I this, this is like extra thing and then I cut my thing in here and I press that scot tape in there and then also same thing in this upper area that way now there happened I, I cut better part I start in here that way and I insert this my tape in there and I press that then I cut this in here. Okay, and this is excellent, excellent, excellent repair. And in same way we can do that whole line if it is loosened or we have replaced it. And now we need to only wait something like two hours and then there is this amazing 200 kilos or this uh, 400 pounds or what is 500 pounds force in there. And actually this, uh, this force, if we, are, if we are looking this full 500 pounds force, we need to wait one, one day. But within two hours there is at least, I believe, that 200 pounds force. And we can remove these tapes in here. And, and then this door is ready for use. Okay, and that was my information. And please, the most important things to learn and what, is, what I like to say is that we need high quality products. And this 3M is high quality product for this tape and then this my favorite clue what is this Sika, Sika brand from Switzerland and there is also this glue and elasticity material this is the, the maybe the most important thing that we have high quality glue in this very difficult wet position okay and this was this information and thank you for watching that video and have a nice day to you